I'm going to do my uh, post-game review of mine and Ford Tufts uh, Auburn LSU National Championship game uh, or post-game report, whatever you want to call it. Um, going into the game, I would I had expectations of wanting to win, but I uh, the way the first game went, he just he really the score could have been worse than it was, and uh, I didn't expect us to be able to play with him. He, him stopping my run like that, and as as I'm based on running the ball real well, um, I just get into some some stuff about us playing. Started off, uh, he drove right down the field. I deferred to the second half. He drove down the field. Um, and kicked a field goal. Uh, I got the ball back. I, I really can't go into all the interceptions and stuff because there were so many. I think I had six turnovers and he had four. Um, but uh, I, I didn't score for the first quarter. It was 3 nothing into the first quarter. He was playing really tough D, um, making some real good picks, pressuring my quarterback where I just threw it up and, and he, he'd pick it off. Um, second quarter, uh, come out they uh he connects on a on a it says here a 38 yard pass to to chris tolliver um he he scored went up 10 to nothing uh, i was getting kind of worried 10 nothing against ford tough uh you, you're not gonna win many of those uh, then to make things worse i get the ball back and um i fumble I think I think he. Oh, I know what it was on this one. I was rolling out with my quarterback and was going to go throw downfield, and uh, it was like a it was like a blotched pass, but it, they called it a fumble. I guess it went behind me. Um, he picked it up and went into the end zone. Um, went up 17 to nothing. Uh, the Tigers are in panic mode. Uh, he he's got me on the ropes. Um, Came right out the next series, um, threw a quick slant to one of my wide receivers, and he took it uh, 77 yards for the touchdown. Um, just, uh, I think uh, Ford went for the pick on the play uh, and, and didn't get it, and I, I got behind his man, and he couldn't catch me, uh, so I went for the score. Then he got the ball, drove down, kicked a field goal with a minute left in the half, he gave me the ball back. I had a, had a good kick return, um, and then moved the ball down the field, uh, and got on his side of the field real quick, and then hit Antonio Goodwin on a streak. There wasn't nobody around him. He, his guy almost knocked the ball down, but he didn't get it. Um, and we were went into the half. Uh, I believe it was 17, no, 20 to 14 at the half. Third quarter, we came out, um, made some halftime adjustments, decided really our big adjustment was um, we were going to pass the ball on first down and run the ball on second and third down, um, being as if we got a little room on first. Worked out. I made a few quick passes on them, got them thinking pass, I believe, and then kicked uh, a little Stretch play to Dyer, and Dyer run it. It was a big, it was a big run, 40-something yards, 30 yards, something like that, down to the one. And then I punched it in with Ladarius Phillips, the big 200-290-pound uh, uh, fullback I got. Um, and the score was in 21 to 20. Auburn was up. Um, I don't, I'm not sure how I got the ball back, but anyway, I scored again on a. A third, I got down inside his twenty, on, inside the ten, twenty, scored on a thirteen-yard strike to my my tight end Mosley, and um, we were up uh, at that time twenty-eight to twenty, and looking good, playing real uh, better ball in the second half. Uh, but not to be outdone, they, LSU gets the ball back. They drive down the field. Um, he scores on a on a pass to his wide receiver, and it makes it 28-27, uh, Auburn winning at the end of the third quarter. Um, fourth quarter, we come out. 
I think it was like our second play. Uh, I hit a I hit a pass to my tight end right over the middle. He was really running like a post corner there, and I I did stick control and threw it to the outside. There wasn't nobody out there, and he caught it and and Lutz and Kirchin rumbled for 79 yards for a touchdown. That was the end of the scoring in the game. 35-27, um, we just went back and forth in the, the rest of the fourth quarter with turnovers, had a lot of turnovers. Um, like I said, I had five, I threw five interceptions, he threw three, we both had a fumble. Um, uh, I threw for 434 yards, It was real, that's really the breaking point for us. Um, Neither one of us broke 100 yards rushing. Um, Clint Mosley, my quarterback, had 393 yards passing. My backup came in two times because Mosley got hurt. Um, Barrett Bailey had his quarterback, had 247 passing. Both our running backs, Dyer only had 92 yards, no touchdowns. Blue had uh, 63 yards. That's a real testament to our um, defense because those are the two best rushers in the league to hold both of those under 100 yards is the SEC defense. Um, besides that, it was a real good game. I give uh, Ford tough all the props in the game for playing a real tough game and making me adjust a lot. Um, I'm really glad to overcome all the turnovers that I had to win the game. Uh, it's nice to be the champs. Auburn Tigers, national champions this year. It ought to give us a big boost in recruiting. And uh, we look forward to doing the off season and starting next year. Um, this has uh, been a review of the Zeros to Heroes National Championship. Thank you.